Hey guys. Good evening everybody. Hey guys, I hope that you can see me fine. How's everybody doing? You were thinking that I was not going to do a live, huh? Oh, guys, it's been a long day. Hey, Jane, how are you? Hey, Betty. Okay, guys, I'm starting uh, to slowly see your comments. So, hey, Judy, how are you? Okay, my friends, so welcome to Larif. Um, thank you for joining me tonight. Hey, Sandra. It's been a long day, my friends. Whew, I got a... I did a lot of running today, my friends. Hey, Rosemary. Okay, so tonight we're going to be designing this tobacco uh, basket, my friends. And I, I need to remove the tag, don't I? So we're going to be creating something hopefully pretty on uh, something pretty on this basket. And so it's going to be a fall design. Hey, Regina, how are you? Welcome. Hi, Miss Lisa. Miss Lisa, I'm going to send you a message, Miss Lisa. You're in so much trouble. <laughs> hey, Barbara. How are you? All right, my friends. So good evening, everybody. As you are jumping on, my friends, let me know where you're watching. So that way I know where all my my supporters, all my followers are at. And um, tonight we're going to be making a fall design on this beautiful tobacco wreath. I mean, uh, basket, sorry. And hopefully you will enjoy tonight's design. My friends, do me a favor. If you can please, please, please share my video, I would very much appreciate it. And hey, Karen. And if you have any questions, go ahead and ask anything that you might want to know. And I will try to do my best at giving you an answer. However, if for some reason I get too busy and too carried away with just looking at this thing here, Oh, thank you so much, Joanne. Just let me know, all right? Uh, I will go ahead and give you an answer, okay? I will just write your question, and I will go back through comments, and I will give you an answer, okay? All righty, my friends. So let's go ahead and get started. Hi, Diane. Thank you so much for doing that. I appreciate it. Okay, my friends, so this tobacco basket, you already know where it came from, right? So this is a Hobby Lobby item. So tonight, we're going to be designing something pretty on here. It's going to be a fall design. And so we're going to add all sorts of pretty things in here. Hopefully, it will turn out okay. Um, and let's go ahead and get this party started, my friends. Alrighty, thank you so much for watching me, dear. I appreciate you. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to be uh, placing on this uh, design, guys, is going to be this hydrangea uh, stem, okay? And this one I got locally here from one of the suppliers that I normally go buy things from. And I've been having it for a while. I mean, I got it like, I think during spring and I never got to it. So we're gonna go ahead and use this pretty stem for tonight's uh, design, okay? And so I have already cut part of the stem, and so I'm gonna go ahead and place it. Hey, Delia, how are you, dear? And so I'm gonna put some glue on it. I don't think I'm gonna need a pick, so I'm just gonna try inserting this without a metal pick from with my pick machine. Hey, Debbie, welcome, honey. And so I'm just gonna put a little bit of glue on it before I try to or attempt to insert this. Hey Mia, welcome. And so this is gonna be the very first thing I'm gonna place, my friends. Oh, it went in easily, quick. And without much trouble, yay. I like it when it works out like that, my friends. Okay, 
So that's my very first item. And so my second item is going to be a small a pumpkin, okay? Hello, everybody. Hey, Miss Donna, how are you? And so the next one is going to be this pumpkin right here, okay? And so I want to do this like that. So that means that I need to insert this in some sort of angle. And so I'm gonna try to see if I can make the hole with this. Uh, hey, Delilah, how are you? Guys, you won't believe. I went to, um, oh Lord, and I forgot him again. I went to, um, I went to, um, Dollar General to see if I could find me more scarecrows. And, uh, I didn't find scarecrows, but I found some witches' heads that were almost as big as the scarecrows. And I was so excited. <laughs> Am I the only one that gets excited over stuff like that, guys? Please tell me I'm not the only one. So I think I need to probably do it more towards this side. So I'm trying to make a hole here on my pumpkin, guys, so I can insert the, um, the wood pick. Okay. So I'm able to put this in here. And so we'll see how that's gonna go. Okay, so now I'm gonna cut it because I really don't need it to be that long. Okay, and I'm gonna try to insert this. Hopefully it will go in also without a bite. Joanne, why is that? All I keep on telling you guys, all I can tell you is keep on going back because, you know, um, I think it paid off for Mary. Mary kept on going back and I think she ended up finding what she was uh, trying to. Oh, I broke it. See, I pushed it too hard, my friend. So we're going to go ahead and take this again. So I think this next time, instead of pushing it that hard, I'm going to do a uh, pick. So we're going to redo this. So here we go. Second time. <laughs> so I know, guys, and it was like, oh, my God, I cannot believe I'm seeing this. Those uh, witches are pretty. I'm going to show you. If I was not so bad with my memory, I would have brought him from my car to show you. But I'll show you next time. I'll take a picture of them and I'll show you. All right, guys. So I'm going to attempt to insert this again. Hopefully, I won't break it again. So we'll see. Yeah, now, now it went in easy, but it's not in an angle I want it. So I'm going to try to do it again. Put this in the wrong angle, my friends. I'm gonna see if I can get it done this time. Ah, okay, better, much better. You know, dollar. Let me tell you something. Um, I went to my ninety-nine cent store. Oh, by the way, guys. The 99 cent store, if you have one in your area. <laughs> yeah, it's all my fault, huh? <laughs> hey, I was going to tell you guys, I went to the 99 cent store during my lunch hour. They're starting to put even more Halloween items out. Can you believe that? These are new items. They're not the same ones that they've been putting out. These are new ones. And um, what I like about it, I'm not liking this pumpkin here, guys. I'm sorry. 
this is as you know that I if I'm not happy with something I'm not leave, leave it there so we're gonna try this again until I get it right because I gotta be happy with the way I do things so <laughs> and so they're new items and guess what some of those pretty items are lanterns some very pretty lanterns okay now I'm good guys with batteries and they're so pretty i got me three of them i didn't read donna's comment guys i'm sorry okay so now that i have my pumpkin in i'm gonna do my bow let's go ahead and get this bow started or rolling here this back a little bit hey Carolyn so I'm gonna hey look at this boat uh, this uh, ribbon guys this came from Costco isn't it cute it's kind of like it's a teal color but if you can see those polka dots are with green and some lime green and some emerald green in it and they they turn uh, like different colors as you move it around a little bit kind of goldish a little bit so I'm gonna use some of this to go with the hydrangeas and so let's see how this is gonna go and I do one tails on this uh, on this bow so I'm gonna do a little bit of tails in here like this I might cut them but I will definitely I'm definitely gonna do streamers on this one I know Donna that's why I made that on purpose because I think it's going to look good and uh, I think it's gonna look good I think we're gonna like it hopefully we'll like it right hey Nancy how are you Yes, guys, I came home and I had to do a bunch of stuff. And then I we didn't make it to the grocery store this weekend. And we had to go get groceries. And oh, guys, I hate grocery shopping. I don't know if you do, but I do. My husband says, we need to enroll in one of those programs where we just... Order online. And I said, you know what? That is a great idea. So we're probably going to have to look into that. Where they do delivery of groceries. Hey, Ellen. How are you? Because we both hate it. <laughs> oh, wow. Thank you, Jane. Thank you so much from Australia wow I'm going far guys I'm going far <laughs> so how are you guys doing So right now all I'm doing is, is I'm doing my bow and then I can add the streamers. Oh, thank you so much, Kelly. Oh, Kathy. Sorry, Kathy, I don't have my glasses on. <laughs> hey, Judy. How are you? Okay. So I'm going to do a pick on this one. So it can go easier on here. And let me try to fix this first. Oh, Delia! And what are you going to do to celebrate? ¿Qué vas a hacer para celebrar, Delia? Oh, thank you, Yolanda. 
Thank you so much. Okay, so I guess I can always add things, right, to this bow. So we'll see how this goes. So I'm gonna put a little bit of glue, my friends, in it. And I'm just gonna put it here. Like that. Yes, that's two more. She's gonna be. She's going to be having a birthday tomorrow. Okay, so I'm going to move these um, out of the way for a minute, and we're going to come back to this once we're finished, okay? So we can add the tails. I'm not going to worry about it right now. All right, so right now I'm happy with this. Okay, guys, so let's just start building this up. So we already have, that's what we have right now. Hey, Teresa, how are you? Long time no see. Long time no see, my friend. Joanne, wow, two weeks in advance. Joanne, I will never be able to do that, my friend. Why didn't you just come and do that for me? <laughs> Joanne, you must be a very organized lady if you do that two weeks in advance. Wow. I want to be like you when I grow up, Joanne. That is awesome. Two weeks in advance. Wow. You must you must be a very well organized lady. I don't think I could be able to do that, Joanne. That is really something, my friend. Okay, so let's just start inserting some of these pretty things in here, guys. Yes, guys, what I'm using tonight is a tobacco basket. That's what I'm using as my base. And these were very popular this year, huh, guys? I just hadn't done anything with them, to be honest. I hadn't jumped on the um, tobacco basket wagon until tonight. Kept on seeing it and seeing it and seeing it, and I just have not done anything with it. I said, you know what, since I'm starting late, and it was right on top of my florals, guys, in my garage, and I said, yay, tobacco basket time. Finally, I get to it. Oh, thank you, honey. Thank you so much. Okay, so now since I have already had plenty of green, or not plenty, but some green, I want some orange in here, guys. So I'm going to use some uh, fall leaves in here somewhere. So let me see how I'm going to make some of this in here. <laughs> Debbie, I'm like that. You know, sometimes like, during the day while I'm at work, I think it's like, oh my God, what am I going to do for dinner? And so if I kind of remember what we still have, um, 
I call my husband. If he makes it home, or if he comes home early, or whatever the case is, or if he's working nearby, you know, I tell him, can you defrost something? Just take something out to defrost. If not, I gotta do it the night before. If I remember. Because I'm 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 kind of bad, my friends. I don't I don't I do a very bad job with that. I wish I wish I was not as bad, but I am. And that's not good. We're gonna use some more of these here. So let's go ahead and keep on building it. Crock pot. Joanne, I gotta confess something. I don't, well, it depends on the recipe. But I'm not a fan of that. My husband says, my husband says, no, they don't. Because I tell him that I, I feel to, to me, I guess it's because of the way it's cooked, you know. It doesn't taste the same. So it's like I keep on telling him, it's got an aftertaste. And it's not an aftertaste. It's just that, you know, it tastes different because it's, it's not cooked, you know, like, like we're used to cooking. But I have I have uh, tried some recipes and they do come out real good. But for busy people, it's per I think it's great. I think I got me these this was a large bush, and actually this is like the very last uh, branches. I think I got it locally, um, Robin. From one of the suppliers I normally go get stuff from. I don't remember if it was... I don't know if it was Craftix, to be honest. Craftix or Arcadia. I love Arcadia, guys. If you're local, you need to go see that store. Because they have beautiful stuff. They have a lot of pretty things there. Now, the only thing, guys, is that uh, you're going to spend some good money there because um, their stuff is not, like, it's a little pricey, but you know what? It's worth it because it's good quality stuff. So just make sure you have uh, enough when you go. And if you don't want to spend too much, then guess what? Don't don't bring all your all your ways of payment because those are dangerous places, my friends. They are, they have beautiful stuff, beautiful. Oh, you can't, Ellen, go check the Christmas section in um, Hobby Lobby. They normally, uh, there is a section where they have like all the ornaments and all that stuff. Look at the section where they have the woodsy ornaments. They have packages of four or six, I don't remember. They're also icy nests. You'll be able to find them there. Right, Delia? You know exactly what I'm talking about, right, Delia? See, Delia won't let me lie. She knows because she was there. <laughs> So, right, Delia? Did, did you do that? Did you do what I just say? Yes, my friends. 
But I gotta tell you guys that those two places are like paradise. They're like floral paradise. Flowers, ribbon. The ribbon, you drool over the ribbon. But it's not cheap ribbon. But if you're looking for good quality, different patterns, awesome uh, patterns on ribbon, by the way, you need to go see those two stores. They are amazing, amazing, amazing stuff. I'm not making stuff up, guys. Local to the Houston area, you need to ch go check them out. Ellen, where are you located? I know, right, Teresa? See, Teresa, Teresa is saying the same thing. Now, guys, I'll tell you something. Craftix, just for Christmas alone, they have a warehouse. Just Christmas. If you're looking for Mardi Gras stuff, oh, they have a lot of Mardi Gras stuff. Pretty stuff. Those uh, Venetian masks, they have plenty of those. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Gorgeous things. So it's like, I'm, I'm telling you, it's, uh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful, beautiful. I need to uh, take a trip there this coming weekend because I need to um, I need to work on some projects and they have some cute stuff that I want to see if I can get. And also, guys, um, Arcadia. They do uh, demos sometimes. They have like, um, I think they should probably coming up with one uh, for fall. They do one around fall. They do one around Christmas. And they do one around spring or Easter. And uh, they, the designer there, Kim, she is the owner and one of the designers there. She personally designs things very talented lady and so um she is the one uh showing or not showing uh teaching the class and uh she is an awesome designer she is an awesome designer so beautiful beautiful things that they make there So her, along with her assistant or her other designer, Lupita, oh my goodness, they design beautiful stuff. And for Craftix is uh, Mike and Tina, and they're both amazing too. So um, I don't think they, um, they have demos there though. But if you talk to, if you need any info or any advice on things, uh, Mike and Tina, they're both very helpful and they would not mind, you know, answering any questions you might have. Very talented designers, my friend. Very, very talented, both of them. Amazing work they put out there. So how is this design looking? Are you liking it? It's very pretty. 
I think that blue stands out really nicely. Believe it or not, this is almost done. I just need to put some filler flowers in there. And I'm going to try to see what I'm going to do for that. So I'm going to put some yellow here. Yes. Yes, Betty. I have gone there like to two of their demos. And last time I think that I got sick and I didn't go, but um, I would say go guys, keep an eye on them and they, they will post it. At some point they're gonna post them. And uh, that's something that you wanna go check out. And uh, they, they have things for just about any holiday, like in regards to um, as far as decor goes. Kim makes amazing uh, seasonal trees, like for fall or Halloween, Mardi Gras, Texas. They made one for the Astros when they won the championship. Uh, they, I mean, whatever you want, they probably have it. So pretty stuff, pretty, pretty stuff. They are definitely not short of talent, my friends. It's amazing people, amazing talent there. Wonderful, wonderful stuff. Hi, Bonita. How are you? So this coming weekend, I need to go, guys. I need to go check it out, see what I can find. Um, because I'm running out of things and I need to find me some stuff. Uh, a lot of times, guys, I don't even know what I'm looking for until, until I actually see it. I mean, I have an idea of what I want to find, you know, but, um, but I don't know if I will lie or, or, or believe that I know what I want, but. You know, I sometimes I don't. I only go with the flow, and if I see something that I like, then I'll get it. But see how pretty this thing is looking? I know, the at home has a lot of yellow. Yeah, I bought a lot of my yellow there. I bought a lot of my yellow I buy there. A lot of it. I mean, they have like all sorts of um, different textures and stuff in there. Thank you, Pat, for stopping by, honey. I know, guys, I'm starting late. I just did not want to not do it. I was running so far behind on things, my friends. That is not even funny. Thank you so much. Oh, Miss Pat. Let 
Thank you, Kathy. Thank you so much, honey. No, uh, Diane, what I did is I spray some foam on it. However, you don't have to spray the foam. You can place a piece of styrofoam in there. You just wire it, use floral wire to attach it or zip ties. Either way will work very nicely and it will hold up to it really nice too. So, um, so yeah, you can definitely use a styrofoam. Yes, yes, ma'am, you can. I love these berries. See how pretty they are? And guys, if you like twigs, um, Arcadia has some, a lot of them. Very pretty ones. So it's pretty much, you know, how, um, what your budget is, my friends. Cause like I said, it's, it's not, it's not gonna be low. But I would say, guys, that if you take your time to look, you can find good stuff at good prices. So don't, don't get discouraged. Okay, so this is looking really nice, my friends. I like this. I like this a lot. And I just feel that I need a little bit more wispiness in here. So let me see what else I can do in there. And I probably want something out there to stand with that blue, I mean that green on the back. So I'm just probably going to do this one on the bottom. I mean not on the bottom, but on the back. In the back. So I'm gonna bring this down so I can reach. didn't do it before so now I need to I have that uh, the same mugs um, my tea mug look I have glue on my mug so what do you think guys are you liking this you like you like see how big this is this looking very big and so I think what I want to do guys is I want to um, do some petals 
believe it or not, I want more streamers on here. So I'm going to do some of these ones. I want this and I need one of the um, teal. Thank you guys. So I'm just going to pinch it in the middle. I need a piece of my pipe cleaners. And I need a smaller one. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you so much, dear. Thank you, darling. Okay. So I'm going to... Glue these a little bit. And now I have these. I might cut this a little bit shorter. And then, so that way I don't have too much length on everything. I would rather have the streamers longer. And just cut it a little bit. You're canning too, Donna. Hey, you guys are busy with just canning your vegetables and everything else. That's something that I have always wanted to learn, my friends. I so wish I could do that. <laughs> If you don't have a pick machine, then you can use your wood floral picks. Uh, let me show you. I have some here. So you find them at uh, Hobby Lobby. And so this is what they look like. Sometimes they're wired but you also find them without wire too. So normally if you buy them with wire, it's easy for to wrap around things, right? And if you don't find them wire, well then buy the unwire one and you can use floral wire or you can use uh, floral. The case of like the tails that I made here, if you did not have the pick, what you're gonna do is you're still gonna do your zip tie, no your zip tie, your pipe cleaner. So let's say that this is your tails, right? So you're gonna do it in the middle, right? And you tie it up like this, right? So since you don't have a pick machine, you're gonna get your, um, your wood pick and you're gonna wrap this around you can grab the uh, 
water it's okay you can grab it all together and you're gonna wrap it around if and if you can it's better if you put a little bit of glue so it can it won't you know come loose as you are pushing it in there you cut in the um, foam okay but that's how you do it zucchini bread can you believe I've never eaten that I need to eat that I've never eaten zucchini bread I want to put like some um, like a uh, some um, leaves in here guys just so it won't be so like empty there so I'm gonna put just this here I'm gonna put a little bit of glue on the back it doesn't even have to be much I just want something to keep it together in there and I'll just do this like that okay If you want it, you could do more twigs on here. Um, <clears throat> but what I'm also going to do is some of these so it can look more fall. So you can add as much as you want on here, you know, if you like it with more wispiness and things like that, well then you just If you like more of a wild look to it, you can just add probably a couple more of those, maybe one or two more. So there you have it, guys. Now, if you want, um, we can also do probably a little bit more of this, and we can do it through the outside. So it can look fuller. So we do it from the bottom, from one of the holes on here. Like that so it can look fuller on the sides let me see if I can add one more on the other side because if I'm doing one on one side I like to add one on the other one so you can look balanced oh this thing just jammed on me well I'm not gonna mess with it
Okay, guys. So there you have it. So how do you like it? So let me bring you straight or closer to this thing. So that's what it looks like, my friend. Farmer's Market. Yeah, there's a lot of vendors selling uh, handmade <clears throat> breads there. And so I guess those recipes are different, right? Thank you, Melanie. I appreciate it. All right, my friends. So I really hope that you like today's design. Thank you so much for joining me. So um, last minute. And uh, so I appreciate you spending time with me uh, here today, guys. So I hope that you have a great night. Hey, Mary Louise. And so I will see you next time again, okay? And hopefully next time I will go ahead and um, show you those witches that I was telling you about. And uh, they're beautiful. I fell in love as soon as I saw them. It's like, oh. I hadn't seen them before and and you know what guys what i tell you is true you need to keep going back to stores because it's slowly but surely they're coming up with new things and as you know we're getting closer to the holiday they start getting more inventory out so um you'll be able to see more stuff that you had not seen before so keep on going back uh thank you judy i appreciate it honey Yes, Miss Delilah. Okay, my friends. So you all have a great night. Thank you so much. And I will see you soon again, okay? Wednesday. No, today is Wednesday, isn't it? No, today is Monday. My goodness, I'm already lost, my friends. So uh, Wednesday is our next meeting, okay? So until then, my friends, you all have a great night. Be blessed. And I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.